thought the, the game went the way we thought it would go. Uh, they, they got a, a good offensive team and they're playing a little bit shorthanded. And that was about the spread that uh, I felt like it would be. Uh, and we were able to close out the game the way we needed to. So uh, happy for that. Uh, we made a couple of three-point shots at the right times and our three-point defense was good again. They go three for 20 and we turned them over 16 times, which was important. We only had eight. So thought all our guys played, did a good job. We shot a good percentage from the floor and uh, we rebounded with them for the most part. On my right, I've got uh, junior Kobe Julian uh, from Baton Rouge, Louisiana and all-conference, another all-conference player, Hosanna Katinga from Crawley, England. We'll up Coach, you, uh, I kind of wrote something down here. 11.40 left, it's 52.41. Garnett makes a layup, and you called timeout right after that. Got a turnover, and then from there you go on, I think, a 13-2 run after that. Was that, that timeout, was that intentional, kind of trying to shift the momentum there? Yeah, I wanted uh, to, for them to think about the, the play, obviously, and then for us to get back out there defensively, and we got the ball back. I think it's when we got a trap at half court and we're able to steal it right back. So, and we had a couple of timely buckets in there. Uh, looked like we were gonna blow the lid off a couple of times, but we couldn't quite do it. A couple questions here from Zoom, Coach. Uh, it looked like the halftime plan was to get Katinga involved early in the second half. I'm sorry? Was the was part of the halftime plan to get Katinga involved early in the second yeah, half? Yeah, we always try to get him involved. And, and I just told him in the locker room when I went around and shook everybody's hand that, H did a great job getting us off to a good start. He made some tough buckets and, and made an and one, made his free throws. Uh, and so I celebrated a little bit too much. One time when he scored, I thought he did a heck of a job. And then Coach, uh, Kobe hit a rough patch offensively over the final few games, but really stepped up today. What did you see from him on the floor today in this matchup? Well, he, he made three point shots like he does. I thought he rebounded the ball at times for us. Uh, came up with five and he scored the ball. He made tough two point shots playing off two feet for most of the, the game. Uh, and, and his defense was good too, but he didn't control both. Or I'm, I'm not worried about those guys. They're gonna make shots when the opportunity presents itself. And then uh, for Kobe here, talk about how aggressive you were uh, getting to the basket today. <clears throat> uh, I just knew to get to the paint. Um, that's what I thrive in, just play in the paint, play off two. And I know I'm pretty strong. Not too many people are able to bang me down there. So I just got down there and they got us up to a good start. And then one more here for Coach. Uh, Coach, it looked like foul trouble could have been a problem there in the second half. Uh, how did you kind of deal with that uh, in the second half here? I thought we rotated our lineup pretty good. And the, the freshmen, three freshmen played for us and did a nice job. Everyone scored uh, tonight. and. Almost everyone got a rebound with one guy didn't get a rebound. But I, I, I thought that that helped a little bit. We were worried H got three, I, I set him for a minute and uh, just wanted to make sure he was there to finish the game if we needed him to play inside out. Ozana, I know it was a while ago, but you played at Coastal. Did it have anything kind of extra motivation? I know really it's a tournament. I know you don't need much extra, but did yeah, you have anything? No, um, <clears throat> every game's important and uh, obviously the tournament games are just uh, that much more important. Um, no game really holds much weight, like uh, a significant more weight than others, but it feels good to, to beat them in the tournament in advance, for sure. Another one here for both of the players. The team's now won you know, two games in a row after a little bit of a rough patch. Do you feel like you're back where you were uh, a little earlier in the season? Uh, yes, I think so. Uh, it made us lock in and refocus. Uh, the losses made us determine what we needed to do better and play. We needed to play more as a team. Uh, I think we started doing that the last two games and the results we did the same. Coach, it's the second time you kind of went back to Hardy starting with Kentrell off the bench. And again, he makes three more threes and had a couple more kind of big plays on defense. You just, you liking that switch up and having him off the bench now? Yeah, I, I felt like Brandon didn't uh, score the ball early uh, from three. He didn't shoot great, but he did, he did make one shot one for six, but his defense was good. And I, th I feel like it gives him some confidence going in. Um, and, and we need everybody on the team. And Kentrell's great. He wants to win. That's all he cares about. And we know what a deadly three-point shooter he can be. He's done it before here. And uh, hopefully he can make some more on Saturday. For all three of you here, uh, is there an advantage to playing more recently than your opponent heading into your next matchup? 
want to. Was there anybody? <laughs> oh, uh, yeah. Hopefully, uh, hopefully, moving forward uh, into Saturday's game, Cole shooting 10 or 15 tonight. Hopefully, he keeps uh, having a hot hand and uh, a couple of us step up on Saturday. But, yeah, we will definitely see that as an advantage. Get on the court, get used to the goals and stuff, and then just get ready for Saturday's game, really. Both these guys played well against Arkansas State, certainly in Jonesboro and in Lafayette. So we have a lot of respect for them. They're, they're a much better team than than some of the teams in our league, and it doesn't surprise me that they, they slipped into that fourth spot. But very good offensive team, and we were able to control them by having uh, a low volume of three-point shots made, and that's what we'll have to do on Saturday. Any final questions? All right. Thanks, Coach.